Hello everyone, my name is Hannah Riding. I'm a teacher candidate at Queen's University, and with Science to Rendezvous Kingston, in this segment, we're going to be learning about Helen Reynolds Bellier, the first woman to work alongside male colleagues as a geologist. Born in 1913 in St. John, New Brunswick, to a family with French ancestry, Helen Bellier grew up around the ancient mountain ranges of the East Coast. Bellier was an active mountaineer, hiker, skier, and a horseback rider. Before she devoted herself to geology, Bellier worked as a high school teacher and served as a lieutenant in the Royal Canadian Navy. At the University of New Brunswick in 1934, Helen completed her Bachelor of Arts degree in Languages and Geology. She completed her Master's in 1936 at Dalhousie University in Nova Scotia and received her PhD in Geology at Northwestern University in Chicago. Bellier joined the Geological Survey of Canada in 1945, and in 1947 she was given a new job as a geologist. Female geologists with the Geological Survey were barred from fieldwork until 1970, but Helen Bellier is a notable exception. In 1950, the survey opened a field office in Calgary, and Dr. Bellier and a male co-worker were sent west to help monitor new oil field discoveries. This same year, oil was struck in Leduc, Alberta. Bellier was sent to help monitor their oil discovery, making her the first female Canadian geologist to work in the field alongside only men, gathering samples and transporting them a task that was considered too hard a labor for women, and studying rocks and mapping the Earth's surface and subsurface, which few women had done in the field alongside their colleagues at the Geological Survey of Canada. Her first paper on the relations of reef and off-reef sequences in the Upper Devonian was published in Geological Survey of Canada in 1952, detailing the evaporates of the oil and gas-rich formation, which was then given group status by Bellier. She would carry on geological research in th into the Devonian system at the Institute of Sedimentary and Petroleum Geology, where she spent 35 years with the Geological Survey. Here, Bellier would become internationally recognized for her knowledge of Western Canada's Devonian reef system and its relation to nearby sedimentary basins. She published maps and texts for the whole Devonian region based on her work in the late 1950s. During her 40-year career, Helen Bellier wrote more than 30 scientific papers. Helen officially retired in 1975, but continued to work for several years as a research scientist. Bellier's many awards for her contribution to geology in Alberta includes the Barlow Memorial Medal, which when awarded in 1958, made Helen the first woman recipient, acknowledged for her contribution to geology in Alberta. Additionally, she was elected a Fellow of the Royal Society of Canada in 1962, and was also made an honorary member of the Canadian Society of Petroleum Geologists in 1966. In 1976, she was made an Officer of the Order of Canada. Helen Bellier was a Canadian geologist best known for her research in Western Canada of the Devonian system. She began to work in Alberta when the petroleum industry was a man's world. Bellier was the first woman to work with men before the 1970s and was an advocate and inspiration for women wanting to work in the fields and in the fields of geology and petrology.